Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the channel. Today I'm going to show you how to set up combined shipping rates for a variation of products in your Shopify store. It's relatively easy, so stick close and let's dive in. So you begin here in Shopify and you want to jump into apps.shopify.com and you want to make sure that you are downloading the shipping rates ship easy integration which you can install onto your Shopify store. Now once you're done you'll have something that looks like this. The first thing you want to do is make sure you're going into settings on the left hand side which is the settings of shipping rates and we're going to scroll all the way down to the bottom where it says sync options you want to make sure you are syncing your products okay so this will mean that shipping rates has access to the products on your Shopify store. The next thing we need to do is go over to scenarios. Now Scenarios are things that you basically create so that you can combine your shipping rates. Now, one of the ways that you can combine shipping rates, and probably the easiest, is if you go into products and you open up one of your products, you can add tags to your products. So make sure that you're adding a specific tag to a group of products that you would like to combine shipping rates for. So let's say we're going to use painting as an example. We're going to go now and make sure that all the products that we would like to combine with the shipping rate has the same tag. We're going to go over back to the shipping rates and we're going to find that scenarios button hit that button and this window will open now from this window you'll see the add scenario button on the top right hand side and this is where it gets serious you'll have to give it a scenario name now we're going to name it the thing that we have tagged our products with so it's painting we are going to go down here and we're going to leave the all conditions must match. We're going to leave that there and the cart, the quantity, you can change from quantity, weight, um, length, height. I mean, it depends on what products you are selling and what best fits the description. OK, so the conditions are, let's say, perhaps we're going to go with weight and it's going to be equals to a certain amount all right um, in this situation we are going to go ahead and we're going to use tag because this is what we're working with so tag and here we're going to put in painting this is the tag that we're using we can add an additional condition here but we're going to leave it just as is from here you'll have to add a shipping rate so once you click on add shipping rate we're going to just go ahead and we can just name it shipping rate 3 we're going to go down we can give it a description, we can add some notes, but then right over here, select the criteria for calculating the shipping rate. OK, and over here you will select either quantity, weight, cart, total, whatever it is that will fit the products that you're selling. Under rates, we have fixed amounts or percentages. We have range values or a base value. OK, so we're going to go with the base value and we can give it a value so let's say it's 10 and we can increase the rate by 10 every 50 grams we can then also skip incremental rates that's optional for now we're going to leave it as is we can also offer discounts and we can have that in percentage or a fixed amount as you're going down here you have a maximum shipping rate which you can set and you can add on a handling fee now right at the bottom it says combined shipping rates here again you want to put in here painting fantastic we're going to go up here and say save and make sure that you're doing this for multiple products and making sure that you can do these multiple product groups in different tags all right so once you go out here you'll have painting i've got music as well and from here on the left hand side you're going to go combine shipping rates now once you do combine shipping rates here you can combine different shipping rates with the same product so we're going to go ahead we're just going to call it combined shipping rates and from here we can add again notes descriptions but at the bottom this is what we're looking for okay so the combined rate condition all tags must have value or all tags should have any value okay so the combined rate type you can either combine your rates the sum of you can average them out you can use the highest rate or the lowest rate my suggestion is using the average you can also add tags over here all right to combine so this is where you will add the tags that you've created previously so music painting those are the two tags that i created you can also add tags that should be excluded and then a maximum shipping rate which is optional as well and go ahead and set 
save and you now have got combined shipping rates for multiple product ranges on your Shopify store. Now, if you want to learn more about Shopify, you can go ahead and explore our channel. We've got tons of awesome stuff to show you. So we'll see you over there. Peace out.